Hi, I'm JT Pierce coming to you live from Sport Beach on the beach here in Cannes, south of France, pretty good. Um, and we're celebrating the intersection of sports, of culture, future of fandom with some of the biggest athletes in the world. Um, I am joined here with, by Brie Bowles Marshall. Not an athlete. Not an athlete. Hey, you never know. Never know. Uh, <laughs> Brie Bowles Marshall, lead diversity investment and strategy at General Motors. That's right. Yeah. Awesome. Hey, Brie. Yes. What brings you to Can? Well, JT, I have to tell you, I am so blessed to be a part of an organization called BECA, which stands for the Black Executive CMO Alliance. And through BECA, I've been able to join my cohort here and learn so many new things, meet so many new people. Um, Becca's pillar is to pay it forward. So Becca members are C-suiters, we say CXO, right? CXO um, folks at their respective um, entities and they pour into us day in and day out. And so it's so great to be here with them and it's so great to be able to kind of lean and glean from them. Amazing, Becca, pay Becca, it forward. Becca, pay it forward. How has, how has your can been? I mean, it's appropriately named, can. Um, it has been amazing. There, I, it has unlocked my creativity. Um, I truly feel like there's nothing that I can't do. Um, it's all about um, connecting. It's all about um, learning from each other, building each other, and bringing everyone in inclusively. So it's been amazing. I love that. I love yeah. that. Um, talk to us a little bit about just your role at General Motors and, and, and sort of what you are tasked with doing. Absolutely. So at GM, I, uh, we are um, inspiring to be the most inclusive company of the world. So um, in my role, I lead diverse media strategy and investment, and I bring in diverse owned and targeted media companies into our fold to help bring our strategies to life from a marketing standpoint. Um, and to find those intersections for our brands that authentically resonate with uh, diverse consumer audiences. Amazing. And are you seeing and experiencing things and ideas and insights that uh, you plan to, to bring home with you? Absolutely, absolutely. I've been networking with a lot of people, learning about new platforms and places and spaces where our ads may work, our strategies could work, and uh, so I've got a lot to think about. I'm glad the plane ride home is gonna be a long one. <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly. Um, and then, what advice would you give to other leaders in other organizations that are looking to do the work, that are looking to promote um, equity, diversity, inclusion in their organizations? Just do it. Just do, just it. do it. Which is a perfect thing to say at a sport beach. That's it. Absolutely. <laughs> but just, just do it. Um, I think, you know, we are, are, the population is just becoming more and more diverse all over the world. It is unavoidable. Um, so just lean into it um, and and um, do the best that you can. You know? All right, I got one more for you. Yeah, off, give it off to the me. cuff. We're going off the cuff. Okay. Is there uh, are there one or two initiatives sort of that you're working on back home that you're particularly excited about that you're that you're sort of pushing through and, and, and want to talk about for yes. a minute? Yes. So we are going to be hosting our third annual Diverse Owned Media Summit, July 26th. I'm really excited about that. We invite over 900 diverse owned and targeted media companies to come and learn about us, let us learn about you, so that we can be better educated as to what platforms are out there and how we can engage with them further. So really that. excited doing about that. Doing the work. That. Doing the work. Every Beautiful. day. Every All day. right, well, Bree, uh, thank you. Thank Insightful you. Insightful conversation. That's it for now. Make sure to uh, track us at hashtag SportBeach2023 and check out everything Stagwell's doing.